guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today I've got another little clip from Mount Dora that may or may not be paranormal. Um, I forgot to add it in to the other video, so I thought I'd, I'd just make a quick one for you now. Uh, a little pre-story to the clip you're about to see is, uh, you know, we went to Mount Dora and we checked out the the uh, jail the the city the old city jail that is supposed to be haunted um but we went in and checked it out and we did our thing um so when we were in one of the cells uh i thought i'd get bruno in there and set him up on the bed and take a cute little picture and i took a clip of that as well thought it was cute now what you'll see him doing is acting really strange and I'm going to see if you can pick up on that. Now I'll uh, I'll play this clip for you a couple times and just check it out. He he seems a little weirded out in there. It's kind of like he's looking at something. Here check check the clip out and see what you think. So poor Bruno must have broke the law. He is in jail cell number 14. I'll come and visit you, buddy. I'll come and visit you. Okay? Okay, buddy? So poor Bruno must have broke the law. He is in jail cell number 14. I'll come and visit you, buddy. So that's that's the little clip. Um, something else that I did not get on film because I was not filming at the time was, you know, I do my filming and sometimes I go back and see some things for myself because when you're looking through the little camera screen, you really don't see much. So I was looking around some of the things in the museum part right before you get to the cells and back in the corner I was looking at something. And Bruno didn't want to come. There was a rug on the floor. And he would stop as soon as he got that rug. And he put his paws down. And I couldn't move him. He was dug into that rug. He would not move. He would not come any closer. Um, so we got one of those leashes. You push a button and it gives you more leash. So I did that so I could go over to the corner to see what was going on. Or to look at what I was doing. What I wanted to see. And But he was strange. He stayed right there. And then when I went back to him he was he was shaking he did not want to go near that corner and I, I picked him up and he he just started moving around he thought I was going to take him to the corner and then when I walked farther away he was fine and I set him back down so uh, that was really weird uh, remember not everything's haunted guys but something that is out of the normal and is not normal is paranormal but not everything's haunted and not everything's a ghost. That's why I'm not a ghost hunter. I'm a paranormal investigator. So keep that in mind. I don't put these up here saying this is proof that it's haunted. I put it up here, be, these things up here because it's interesting. You know, that's why I, I, I will share interesting things that I, that I catch on film or on audio. But, uh, so I, I just thought that was cool. Tomorrow which is Saturday, we're going to go back to Dane's Caves, where we did the video of the caves. Uh, the last cave that I was that I was in there, um, it's a big cave, and there was some, some more of that cave I wanted to explore, but it was starting to get dark that day. So we're going to go back, but we're going to meet up with some fans, so this should be pretty cool, and I'll film that too. There's some fans want to meet up with us and, and stuff. So they're going to go to the caves with us and check it out. So that should be interesting. Um, so anyway, guys, remember, uh, not everything's haunted, but there are some things that are. Um, so what do you think? Remember, Shea Bear the Myth, the Man, the Legend. I'll run that clip for you one more time. Okay? 
so you can check it out again and uh we'll chat soon guys take care and be cool so poor bruno must have broke the law he is in jail cell number 14 i'll come and visit you buddy